There it goes. This was from a copper mine in northern Ontario. You could see the green and other stuff in there. So what do you see in this rock? I'm thinking dolomite, hematite. Here's another sample from the same rock. And you can see an awful lot of pyrite in there. This one, the green, I think it's copper. Maybe calcite. There's the pyrites again. Moving down into hematite. I have this one. I left it a bit thicker. It's got a little bit of everything in it. And what I'm gonna do is stick that in uric acid just to see what happens. Right now it's just water and my rock. That's some erratic. There it goes. See how she looks in a few hours. Here they are out of the acid. You can see that the pyrite survived and so did the hematite. Makes for a neat looking sample. This one's even better for the hematite. in the big one. But the question now remains, is there any gold? So, in the gold pan, back to just water again, I can see the hematite, some little pieces of pyrite, there's a pyrite there. Sunlight in the shade. <laughs> See, they almost look like gold, and then they don't. They don't see any gold in the pan, not a flake. So it wasn't associated with the pyrite in these rocks. Well, at least now I know. Thank you so much for joining me. We'll do it again real soon. Bye for now.